So, Big Al, I see you have a football. It's Super Bowl. It's the Super Bowl. And your football is deflated because I'm retiring it. You're retiring it. I get it. Because this is the year that Tom Brady retired. <laughs> Not really going to get that one, Big Al, but... Uh, Look it up. There's a whole story about Deflate Gate. So, anyway, so Big L, you've kind of got a favorite in this Super Bowl game, don't you? Yay, Bengals. You want the Bengals. Yeah, yeah. Boo Rams. Boo Rams. Okay. <laughs> I happen to agree. But be that as it may, what if the Bengals lose? Rams win. And the Rams win. The. <laughs> well, Big Al, he, he wouldn't be very happy, and I wouldn't either, boys and girls. My goodness. You know, sometimes we have our favorites, and we don't like it when they lose, or things don't go the way we want. But I want to talk to Big Al. He's coming, too. Is that what really makes us happy in the end? Oh, to be sad. To be sad, yeah. And Big Al... You'll get over it. You will. Those are not the kind of things that really in the end last that give us happiness. Because think about what are the things that really make you happy? Winning. I mean, besides winning, Big Al, and I mean, deep down inside, well, my mom, your mom, and the fact that she loves you, being kind, being kind. Yeah, but yeah, those are the kinds of things. You know, and sometimes when we lose or don't get our way, it's hard. It's hard. But they can remind us that ah, those weren't the things that were going to make us ultimately happy. But the love we receive and the love we give, that, that is what makes us happy. <laughs> <laughs>